it's official. We're going on an art retreat. Yep, this September we are going to Croatia with me for an art retreat. <sighs> so where am I? I am at a beautiful nature park today and I figured we can just sit down, chat, and we can also hang out with some trees while we're at it. I'm gonna go over all these different things and break this video down into different sections so that you guys could just skip over whenever you want and I'll be able to answer any questions, any comments and give you all the details so you know. It's so peaceful here. I just want to kind of like sleep here <laughs> overnight. Let's get started. So guys, I'm really excited to announce this creative retreat. I just launched the trip and I broke this video down just so you guys can get a better understanding of what it is, what we're doing, why I'm doing this and just how excited I am to be able to host and be of service to you. I'm so stoked to be able to take you guys on a trip and to help you ignite your creative magic in person and to do art workshops together. So the first thing I'm going to start with is the destination. We will be going to Croatia. Croatia may feel like a fantasy land, an ancient storybook kingdom in Eastern Europe whose waters can be described as immaculately blue, paired with rural villages, old traditions, and a cuisine seemingly untouched by time. Experiencing Croatia is much like a fantasy coming to life, and I hope to make it feel just as that. Your host will be moi. If we haven't met, I'm Jess Carp and I am so happy to have you here. I will be your host and I'm very excited to just share these adventures with you. I'm a full-time artist, dancer, creative. I just love sharing my passion over on YouTube and I've been teaching for over 10 years with an experience of all ages, all sizes, all levels, you name it. I was born and raised in New York City and I'm currently living in Miami. But for this trip, I'll be traveling abroad to hang out with you guys. For those of you who are following me over on Instagram, you know, we were in between two places, actually three places. So whoever took the survey on voting on the trip, thank you so much. The winning vote was Croatia and we will be going in September, September 20th to the 25th of 2024 this year. The total duration of the trip will be six days and we will be visiting three cities. That's super exciting because we'll be able to see so much and the way the itinerary is broke down, we get a little bit of nature, a little bit of city, a little bit of food and a little bit of adventure and a lot of fun. We're also going to be on a beautiful coast with insane scenery, which I'm super excited for. And I have a feeling it's just going to blow our minds. I personally have a passion for teaching and just helping others self-development. So a lot of the things that I've structured in the itinerary are going to be to help ignite yours and just help you improve, help you get better, and simply just to have a good time, meet new people, and paint, create on location. Okay, okay, so enough about me and let's continue and begin discussing the rest of the trip. Besides me, we will have a local experience guide, which is pretty cool. They're gonna guide us throughout our time together. They're gonna be with us throughout the whole trip. So it's gonna be me, possibly a videographer to capture the whole trip and our guide, and plus a group of us. The capped amount of people we can have for the trip are about 20 people. So plus or minus, we will see how many people will get on the trip. But I heard that once, if we sell out, uh, they're gonna let me launch another trip. So hopefully we could do that and this can be start of something big and amazing. We already have a structured itinerary, but I did add a little bit of informal gatherings and fun workshops for us. The itinerary will be split up into breakfasts, dinners, activities. Sometimes we're going to be hopping over and transferring to a completely different city together. We'll also have some art workshops and I'm very excited for those. We're going to have a reserved spot in a certain area for us to do that as well. So I'm calling this a creative retreat because we will be doing a little bit of fun, a little bit of wellness, a little bit of mindfulness, and a lot of creative fun. I wanna note this is open to all levels. You do not have to be a pro, you don't have to be a beginner. I always welcome everybody with open arms, so don't worry about that. Here's the breakdown of all the days. Okay, so we do arrive on the 20th of September and then we have a beautiful welcome dinner. You can join me and everybody. We're gonna just have a nice meal, just welcoming each other, getting to know each other. 
and then I want to have a little informal gathering where you can pick up a creative goodie bag from me. After dinner, we're going to settle down and set some intentions. I highly recommend you joining us doing a little bit of journaling together. Hopefully we can do this over sunset depending on how late we finish the dinner. It's really exciting because I'll be able to do a little icebreaker with you guys. We'll do a little doodle session. And yeah, it'll just be a little like chill welcome day to just get accustomed, hug it out and get ready for our first full day, which is gonna be day two. So accommodation is included. We are staying overnight in Split. And on day two, we have our rise and shine for our full day in Croatia. We're gonna have a breakfast, and after breakfast, we are going to transfer to a small town of Skradin, where we will begin our journey into a beautiful national park to see some waterfalls. If you look at the itinerary, I have a little informal gathering now. The difference between informal and formal gatherings is that the informal gathering are just things that we do together that is just all up on our own, super optional. And the formal gatherings are workshop spaces that are provided to us in partnership with Trova Trip. So yeah, I'll have all that covered, don't you worry. And I'll be there and I'll be there to help you guys. So no worries there. On that day, if you feel like waking up early, I know we're gonna have a little bit of a time change and jet lag. I'll be up early for a sunrise meditation if you wanna join me and that will be super fun. This is completely optional. You don't have to come if you don't want to, but I. I highly recommend it and it'll be very special to do it together. We're gonna have breakfast at the hotel and then we are off on our way to our adventure. Transportation is gonna be provided for us. We're gonna hop on a bus and head over to the national park and then we're gonna transfer to a little ferry ride and that's gonna get us into the park itself. So the national park is going to have nature, waterfalls, and this is gonna be where we bring our sketchbooks. Super exciting. And we're gonna do some painting on location. I'll be able to demo and you'll be able to ask me questions. Do it right there alongside with me. I'm going to show you how to approach a painting of landscapes and big landmarks, how we're going to break things down into shapes. And I'll be there right with you. And everybody's going to do it as a collective, which I think will be incredible. So here I welcome everybody to just take photos of things because as we go on and we're going to do different workshops and that's going to allow us to do some little studies together as well. After we do the whole national park and we do that whole activity around mid afternoon, we're going to be transferred privately back to split and that's where we're gonna make some stops and do a little bit of snacks, and then we're gonna stay overnight back in our hotel. On to day number three. Today, we're actually going to bid farewell to Split, and we're gonna hop on a ferry and cruise over to another part of Croatia. We're gonna be going to the island of Korkula. When we arrive, we're gonna transfer to town. And this is where we're gonna explore town, which I'm really excited for because we've got our nature. And then we're gonna go into town and explore the beautiful cobble streets of Croatia. This is gonna be a seaside town full of so many colors, so much beautiful perspective. And I welcome everybody to just hang out with me. I'm gonna be doing out little sketches in different parts and seeing what just grabs my attention. Check out the itinerary on how amazing this place is and how beautiful it is. Um, I'm super excited to sketch here. So we're gonna do an informal gathering, an urban sketch there. Our goal for this one is just gonna be to do a lot of loose drawings. I highly recommend just keeping it simple that day, grabbing a pen and just doing some ink drawings, maybe just with pencil, and just see what catches our eye. Oh, I'm just getting so excited talking about it. Now, once we get back to our hotel, we will have a formal workshop. This will be super chill where we sit down all together as a group and you can have dinner on your own and then we can meet for the workshop. We're gonna share each other's sketches and we're gonna just talk about and have a little critique together, take a look at our artwork. I'll share some of my sketchbook pieces that I did throughout the day can ask me all sorts of questions and we're just gonna do all our talk. Then we have an overnight in that hotel and that brings me to day number four. But first, I'll be right back after this short dance break. Hey, we're gonna take a quick moment to stretch, a little dance break, and I wanna let you guys know and quickly thank our sponsors of our video, Squarespace. If you don't already know, Squarespace is the all-in-one platform for you to build 
your website. Why do we need a website as an artist? Good question. For anybody who wants to know more about you or see more of your artwork or even get in contact with you. And guess what? Squarespace makes it super easy. It's super user friendly. You just like drag a bunch of images into your website template and you're good to go. And did I mention their award-winning templates? They're super awesome, make everything look super professional. So I definitely highly recommend. Oh, and like the best part, it looks great on your mobile device because that's usually where people are going on your website from. Give it a try by going to squarespace.com. And when you're ready to launch, head over to squarespace.com forward slash just carp for 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Okay, let's get back into it. That was a good stretch. Woo. Okay, <laughs> let's go. Today we will be exploring the same island and seaside town, but we're going to be doing something else. We're going to visit Lombarda village and a Croatia vineyard. And then in the second part of the day, we'll have time to relax by the beach and just have a nice session there. Breakfast will be included and our transfers will be included. So we'll just be going out as a group. So on the itinerary, I have an informal gathering that I added myself and this is going to be a beach journaling session. I think this will be super cool because we can sit down by the water. I do this all the time here where I live. I live by the ocean, so I'm constantly writing, sketching, and just thinking and brainstorming by the ocean. I feel like it's super peaceful and the water is crystal clear. Just do a little bit of positive affirmations and uplift one another and do a little beach journaling session. Just a nice way to end the day. Once we get back to the hotel, we're going to be rested. We're going to be recharged. And then we're gonna have a little dinner and go to our workshop number two. For this workshop, I titled it Creative Sketchbook Techniques. Now this is all subject to change, but I'm thinking we can do a little bit of expressive drawings, expressive doodles, and just swatching out different colors and having like a playtime together in our sketchbook. How fun, playtime in the sketchbook all together? I'm in there. And then we stay overnight again in our hotel. Then we move on to day number five. Today we're going to be leaving the island behind and we're going to transfer to a private vehicle to Dubrovnik. We're going to explore a peninsula. We'll make a bunch of different stops along the way and we will also be going oyster tasting. Yum, yum, yum. So I heard the food is incredible in Croatia and I'm a big foodie so I'm very excited to have delicious meals with you guys. After we have breakfast in the morning, we're going to transfer over and make our way. And then we're gonna go to a little wine tasting session. For our pre-last day, we're just gonna hang out with one another and we're gonna have little stops along the way to different places too. We're gonna be walking around a little village and just enjoying our scenery. And then we're gonna have a bunch of free time before we do our farewell dinner. And in that whole free time, I added a little informal gathering and I welcome you guys to just do a little cafe hang with me. So we'll find a little place, either like an ice cream shop or some gelato, or we're gonna find a little cafe and do some sketching, do some talking and just hang out, no pressure, just chill. We'll mingle with each other, we'll share different memories and fun things that happen throughout the trip. And we'll also then conclude our Croatia adventure with a farewell dinner. This is going to be all of us sitting down and just having a nice last dinner with one another before we do our goodbyes on day six of the next day. This dinner is included, so definitely check out the itinerary. I'll have everything up on the screen of what's included and things that will be part of the price. Alrighty. So, Day six, I know it's gonna be super bittersweet. We will have one final breakfast together and then I welcome everyone to do a little goodbye gratitude session. If you watch the channel, you guys know I'm super big on gratitude. I really try to practice it every single day and I found it to be a huge impact on my life. All the things in abundance and more. And I figured we could do this thing like you know when you finish a year in school and you sign each other's yearbooks. I think we can have a little fun session where we sign the back of each other's sketchbooks and all the travel memories we've drawn and that way we can do little wishes for one another and we'll keep those memories and those wishes forever in our hearts. And then we will proceed to our airports and venture back off home 
that will be our last day in Croatia. That's our itinerary. I know that was a lot, but I felt like it would be great to break things down with you and just so you know what to expect and what you're signing up for. Now, let's talk about pricing what's included and what's not. I've broken down a little bit in the itinerary, but let's discuss our prices. Since the trip just launched, we will have an early bird price, which is a little bit cheaper, which we love, right? And then we have our regular price, and that's going to be the price of the trip once the early bird pricing is over. These prices include five breakfasts of all the days and also two dinners throughout our trip. Plus all the activities, all the workshops with me, some free goodie bags. I'm working with some sponsors to try to get all of our supplies and sketchbooks provided. So I will keep you guys posted on that. Hotels, accommodations, all of that is included. Plus the local guides, the city transfers, and of course, all the fun hangouts together. Once you sign up, you can pay a 25% deposit for the trip. That's due upfront, and that is just Trova Trips policy. So once that spot is pending, you have a chance to get your 25% deposit refunded, but once your spot is concluded and once I click accept to you to come into our trip, that 25% deposit is non-refundable. Very important, please do read the policy over on Trova Trip because that is just the way they run things and it's very important for you to make sure that you know what you're signing up for because hey, it is a sum of money, so just make sure you do read the policy and I'll have all the links down below for you to check it out. Once your spot is confirmed, you have till 90 days before the trip begins to pay out the whole thing in full. So you can feel free to pay the whole trip up front or you can just wait and pay 90 days before the trip begins. So here is the date that you should have the trip paid by and everything is confirmed. According to Trova Trips policy, upon 90 days before the trip starts, they cannot issue any refunds. And this is all going through Trova Trip. So this is not going through my website. All payments will be going through there. Very important. Let's talk about what's not included. Now, as much as this is very apparent on the website, people still have questions on this. So let's just quickly go over this. Flights are not included. I repeat, flights are not included. So I will be paying for my own flights arriving to Croatia. So everybody is responsible for their own flights. Now we will be in three different cities and we arrive to one and we'll be leaving from another. So do keep that in mind when you're looking for your flights. You're more than welcome to come to Croatia a day earlier or a day later if you wish to stay a little bit extra. But again, remember that is all under your cost. And also think about certain meals that we'll have throughout the day that's also not included. Let's see, also, ooh, and very important, travel insurance and visas. Make sure you take a look at that because yeah, all those things are things we have to think about when we do travel. But I promise it's all worth it. We're gonna have so much fun and it's gonna be an incredible trip. I think that it's one of the most beautiful opportunities to be able to create together, to sit down together, to do things on location in Croatia. It is my goal and my passion to make this amazing for you. So let's go over a little Q&A from you guys over on my Instagram, and then we'll close it off. Are passports required? Yes, travel documents are required, so be sure to check out what you need. Check out any of your expiration dates on your travel documents so you don't run into any mishaps, and I'll have a bunch of links below so you can check out everything you need. Can I join if I'm a beginner? Absolutely, I have structured everything for all levels, so everybody is welcome. All ages are welcome above 18. How will you decide who gets roommates? This is actually something you request in your Trova Trip portal. You have the option to have a roommate or you can have your own room for an extra little fee. All of that will be visible upon booking. Will you be filming a vlog? Absolutely, I'll be capturing everything and hey, why not? Let's make a movie out of it, right? A common question is, can we join for a day or two? Unfortunately, no. This is just to be fair to all of the participants paying their price in full. In order to participate, you must have a spot secured in the trip. And if you're coming with a significant other or plus one, they must have their own ticket and spot as well. Is it possible to join the trip from Europe? Absolutely, anybody can join the trip from anywhere around the world as long as you have your spot secured and booking complete. 
And last but not least, uh, will you do this again in the future? I'm under 18, but would love to go once I'm able to. Yes, yes, yes. Hopefully we'll have many trips rolling out in the future. And I definitely hope to see you there. The best way to be notified when I roll out another trip or just to stay updated on things, definitely subscribe, sign up to my newsletter and follow me on my socials over on Instagram so you don't miss out any news that's coming. And I'm super stoked to see where this goes. <sighs> so yeah, uh, we covered a lot in this video. I want to say thank you so much for your support thus far. This has been a dream of mine for quite some time and I hope it's going to be a start of something big, something new, something special and I hope to see you there. If we sell this trip out, we're going to launch another one so you'll have a chance to go and I really hope to see you there. Thank you for the bottom of my heart for being here. Consider subscribing. I have a lot of fun, amazing things coming and I will see you in the next one.